What's up, familia? Beautiful day at Walmart. Yes. Yes, I did get a pedicure with my mother. It was... It was pretty good. Um, so basically, we're just gonna go look for her. Um, today, we're gonna do a shoot with the cookies. And whoever is into food photography, I wanna please help them out if whoever is starting or already started doing that. Um, help them get a little better at it. Let's go look for mother. Let's go look for motherland. Right now that I'm um, pretty much, I guess, vlogging, you can say. Um, everybody's gonna use be staring at me and I was aware of that and you know like today's podcast is gonna be how to market yourself and that's what I want everybody to be doing so stay tuned fam <sighs> so my mother takes forever so this this lady got me today man she's a little she's a little dangerous looking man she's a little dead she, you see she's covering her face that's why that's how she dangerous she is Freaking crazy man. Shit was so weird. This home is still going with my mom. My mom, she's a Facebook vlogger. Let me just tell you that. She's a freaking superstar on Facebook. I don't know how. I'm not good on Instagram, but she's so good at it. She gets a hundred likes from all my aunts. I barely get three likes. My mom, my my dad. And maybe one stalker. That's about it. Um, like I said, we're gonna do a little photo shoot with the cookies. I got some really cool plates. Um, you know, um, I'm getting into media. I'm getting into blogging, 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 blogging. Um, and I just want to share this pod, uh, you know, like podcasts and blogging to whoever you know. Like, it's taking forever to start. Um. Gary V definitely always stopped me and he's a big influence on me um, even though you know he's on Instagram and all this stuff um, you should go do it and the fear of not doing stuff is the fears that are the fears that are gonna hold you back for the longest no matter if it's your career your relationship your wealth whatever if you hold back in life and you hold back on the things that you want to do because of what other people will say will never work for you will never work for you um i think she's almost done um i don't know nah i think she's about to pass out <laughs> i'll come back with the photography stay tuned with the focus all around this empty town i'm searching for the lost and found but you don't care you're on the way Moving like the scars aren't even there It's in the air like a blazing flare Alright, so to, since I don't have any assistance right now and I'm here, I don't have a assistant right now, Casey Valentine is working hard. Um, I have some delicious green bites um i made a couple days ago and i made almost twice this maybe a little less my brother destroyed all the chocolate plus and the go nuts my mom tear it up so these are the ones that i got left uh this is the plateware that i'll be using today um i said i was gonna talk about a little bit about um today um, and I will um, this is this is a really basic camera I think it's a D3300 um, I got it maybe I want to say uh, like a year ago and I've been taking photography forever with it um, this is not my lens uh, this is a 35 millimeter um, I usually use the one that comes with the with the with the camera itself 
because it's so simple to use, very simple to use. Um, as far as iOS, I go as low as, as I can, and as far as weather, well, it just got very, very dark, because of course, of course, of course, man, of course, nature, you freaking, uh, right now, it's the golden hour, so in photography, um, that's gonna be the best time to shoot, okay it's like right before the sunset um and you get actually some kind of like a blue light in the back all right let me figure out how to open this all right i guess we're staying indoors um <laughs> um so the ios is very important um the weather should be nice natural light is beautiful beautiful um what else what else what else what else definitely light that iso on your camera being low as possible um a good lens one that you feel comfortable with it you know you don't have to go nuts and get the really expensive one it's just gonna mess you up um and definitely you know just have the good product you know right in front of you know what you're gonna shoot what do you want? Usually my photography is very simple. I like to just focus on, you know, like the cookie, the cookie. I don't like, well, I like these messy plates a lot, but I love these beautiful cookies. Um, here I did a little bit of a white vegan chocolate chip, um, and then I just did a little almonds in all of them. But definitely those are my keys when it comes to you know, for photography and when it comes to cookie photography. Um, that's the set. That's it. I'm going to shoot now. Um, I think I'm just going to post it for tomorrow. I have to do a podcast. I have to edit a lot of content that I have backed up. Um, and the way it's not helping me. I thought it was going to be like light, but it completely went from sunset, 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 dark. So I just freaking kill the vibes, man. Kill the vibes, man. I right, I'll talk to you guys later. Now we will go back home today, eh? Until the very last hour. We still got a few more days to slay, eh? It's gonna get so much louder. Now we're here to take control over your body and over your soul. We What's up, fam? We are at Thoughtful Threats and Organic Farm Markets. Uh, we get a meeting with the homie Sebastian. Uh, talk about some, some moves he's making, we're making. As far as social media, um, still waking up. Best photographer in town. Best photographer in town. <laughs> Let's kill it. Let's kill it. Stay tuned, fam. Stay tuned, fam.